Hey guys, Corey here, the Art Archaeologist, and welcome to another intuitive abstract painting, and today we'll be doing page two. So I got these great little tubs at Walmart the other day, and so I just wanted to fill one with some stencils, and I wanted to fill the other one with my mark making tools. So of course I've got my little jelly plate in here, and I think this is going to be really fun to get this good and dirtied up and then pull a print eventually. I need to sit down with an extra piece of paper to pull a print off of this. So I'll have to remember that in the future. And then today, I thought we'd try just a piece of watercolor paper. This does not have gesso on it. And I just wanted to see how it works. And then what I'm gonna be using for my color palette today, I thought I would try some black chalk paint. I'm really interested to see how the chalk paint comes out. And then I want to use my quinacridone Nicolazo gold from golden paint. And then I may throw in a little bit of Titan buff. These two golden paints are two of my absolute favorites from that line. And then I've got, I've got this Anita's acrylic and Sorry, Anitas, but this is junk, junk, junk. It doesn't hold up for me. I want a more stark white. I want a real bold white. So I switched over to the Artist's Loft white and I got better results from it. So that's what I'm gonna be using today. Let's go ahead and do this.
so sorry guys i got distracted and was painting away and realized the camera was off i went ahead and added a bunch of titan buff and i just used the palette knife to scrape it on so that's how i got these marks so sorry about that